Hi. This session we will see how to use different shapes in a workspace, how to drag and drop, and then what is the purpose of versioning here, how to compare one version to another version, we will see. Let me create a new process, one comparison process here. Just I have given the name as a compare. Finish, created. Now observe this. This is a basic process. Let give link, given a link. If you want to deselect the link, you need to click on pointer. Now we cannot close directly the process. When you want to close, it will ask you observe this do you want to save the changes if you want to save the changes just give any comment in this save i have given save changes the process saved and then it closed observe here it given one entry under version history right today's date and then edit summary is save If you want to do one more change for the same process, let me open the same process. Process open. Now here, if you want to use any of these shapes in Blue Prism, what we need to do is just hold the shape, drag and drop onto your workspace. That's it. Observe this. Hold your shape any shape drag and drop onto the workspace the shape will come into your workspace now same shape if you want to use again and again then no need to drag and drop n number of times we have a option to select when you click once on your shape the shape will be selected and if you want to use this, you can click on your workspace. Your shape will be created n number of times. How many times you are going to click it here. If you want to deselect the shape, the same thing. Again, you need to click on a pointer. If you want to delete, then you can use like this all the shapes and then delete button. Deleted. Now we have two extra shapes here when compared to the previous one. Now this one, this is a change for us and we need to save this. Control S, save one, I have given. And save the changes. Now close it, observe. Same process, second time I have changed another entry. Let's say in any organization, when you are working on one process, you are working on one process. Some other person came and they have done some changes. How you will understand what are the changes they have done, right? Every entry, when you are saving, it will make an entry here in a version history. Now here, one more time, quickly I will do another change and I will save the process. Let me add one more thing here and save the process. Save to save now. Close it now. Observe this. We have three entries here. The advantage of this is we can compare and then we can see what are the changes we have done recently when compared to the previous process. But one thing you need to remember here we have comparison option for any two process not more than two you can compare first and last or first and second any two but not all see this compare it will show you the exact difference it's highlighted with the colors it is showing the difference when compared to the one to another the same way observe this 
this one and this one control and select compare it will show you the difference right and if we try to select the three processes three versions see this we don't have compare option so these are advantage of the compare in versioning we can able to understand what all the changes it has been implemented for our previous process in this session what we have learned we learn how to move the shapes into your workspace how to save the process and how to compare how the versioning is going to be maintained thank you